Here's a quick video to show you how to change the font on your new website. So sign into your dashboard. Go down to the page or the post that you want. It's the same way to change the font for both. So for example, I'll just do this to the home page, which is right down here. So once you're in the page that you want to change the font on, go down. I'm going to create a new line so that we can mess around with it. And what you're going to want to do is highlight the font that you want to change. If you don't have that bottom bar already, this right here will open up and close what we call the kitchen sink. So the kitchen sink has a bunch of new options here. Right here, you can change it to a small heading or to a large heading or anything in between. And what the heading is, is it's heading text. So if you had a paragraph about how to change the font right here, and then your next one was how to change the colors, you could have a new heading down here to break it up into different areas. Now, I'm going to change it back to the paragraph because this paragraph size right here is the general size of all paragraph text, just some plain text. I'm going to change it back to that, show you how we can bold it, we can italicize it, we can have a strike through it across things off, we can underline it, we can bullet it, we can number it, we can even put quotes around it, um, center it, right align it, change the color of it, so you can have these choices right here, or you can even go to more colors and pick the different way that you want to choose your color. So you can have any color that you want. I also want to show you how you can indent your paragraphs. So this actually changes the whole paragraph and pushes it in. And you can run a spell check through it. So if this size of text isn't the size that you want for your entire website for all the paragraph text. What we're going to want to do is go down to REA theme and go to theme options. And now keep in mind this changes the text size for the entire website, not just for that particular pair for that particular page. So now once you're here, go down and find post styling. And like I said, pages and posts are pretty much are the same thing as far as the styling goes. Now to change the size of this font right here, go down to the post text font style. And here right now it's at 16. I'm going to change it up to 40 just so you can see that it does work and how it works. You can also change the color if you want the entire website's color, font color different. You can also change the font type. So go down, click Save All Changes. Go back to your website and refresh it to see the changes take place. And you can see that the size has gone up quite dramatically. And as simple as that, it's a quick change. Um, I'm going to change it back to 16 here. It's a quick change though, easy to do. Um, you can change your post title font. So the post title font here, that would be this font right here. and make sure that you write down somewhere um, what the default sizes were so that if you do want to change it back to a default size that is quick and simple hope that helps